What's going on, y'all? Chris from DraftKingsCaseBreaks.com. We got this Contenders break finished up. The 2021 Panini Contenders three box break number eight PYT. Here is our players and our teams. Thanks again for getting this all filled out. We're doing a $1,000 break credit giveaway at the end, so the two top spots each getting $500. You had to buy two teams to get a spot. We'll explain that a little bit more at the end, but we're all set. I'm going to do a roll of the dice here. We have one, two, and three on the left. So it'll be one stack, the other stack on the right. So one, two, and three on the dice will get the left stack. Four, five, six will do the stack on the right. So good luck. Number two. So we're going to do that left stack. And we will have the ninth and the last break of that case on the website very, very soon. Jasper's case breaks dark. Up already. Up already. Thank you, Joe. Joe working his magic, doing all the hard stuff while I get by on doing the easy stuff. So we'll do break. Good luck, everyone. Thanks again. Yeah, Call of Duty is it's in all of its simplicity and the things that they've done with it it you know i don't like battle royales i don't like warzone really it's 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 passed me by it makes me mad it really does I'm not like overwatch is much better either but i am better at overwatch than i am at any other fps and Apex is just Titanfall 2, so that's my justification for it. That's one on the back there. And let me do myself a little favor, since we just discussed Contenders 9 already being on the site. Just the link, post it in the link. Uh, New York Mayor Eric Adams, not too long ago, says Overwatch is Hanzo is garbage. That <laughs> I play Hanzo. So that's what that's I can. If he means BS, then yes, he would be the mayor. Would be correct. He is a bunch of a bunch of cheese. Because I am good at Hanzo, and it does not require that much to be good at Hanzo. What does Eric Adams know about Overwatch, huh? <laughs> what does he know? His tweet was, I couldn't match the send button fast enough. I may not be a gaming expert, but at least I'm not garbage like Hanzo. So yes, he thinks it's cheese, which again, the mayor would be correct. These are the only kind of politics that I want to talk about. I want to know that's politicians' right. thoughts on video games. That's it. That's it. That's all we'll talk about. I wonder what his thoughts are on the Overwatch 2 beta. I want to hear his thoughts on Gotham Knights. You know? That's all I care about. Alright. All right. Good luck, everyone. I'm, a, I'm in acquaintances with the guy that wrote Overwatch. Yeah, we we met at the uh, the charge game. He's a good dude. That dude knows a lot, obviously. First. No, time. not not him. Oh, someone else. Yeah, he. That that's one of my best friends. who used to work for Blizzard. Nice. That's his friend that I met through him. Big Blizzard guy is Joe. Jalen Phillips, our first auto linebacker for the Dolphins. That's going to Andrew. No, excuse me, Terry. Terry grabbed the Dolphins. Andrew, or Andrew bought the Rams. Our second auto is going to be right up top here. Alex Leatherwood for Joe's Raiders. Offensive tackle. And that's going to Andrew. Andrew S. Rookie ticket auto. So looking for our RPS. Here's Diami Brown, rookie of the year card. 
There's Trevor Lawrence, MVP contender. What do you think Trevor Lawrence's ceiling is? Multiple MVPs, mm. multiple Super Bowls. So you think he's by far the best QB in this draft? He's yeah. better than every. And he's. Do you think anyone reaches like that level, or it's going to be all Trevor Lawrence for the next 10, oh, 15 years? The problem years? is Trevor Lawrence is not bad. Trouble Hubbard. There's our, 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 T, our RPS, the rookie on cards, the RPS ticket. Is that how they're called? No. If you see the the redemption or whatever, I think the RPS means that it's going to be the one that's on card. So Chubba Hubbard on card going to the Carolina Panthers. It's going to Andrew S. once again. Rookie of the year, Davis Mills. See, I feel that way about Justin Herbert. I think Justin Herbert's going to be that guy for a long time. So, I mean, it's going to be just a big rivalry between Herbie and, and T.Y. I think that's good for the league. Hashtag good yeah, for the hobby. Yeah, that would be good for the hobby. It's just the problem, problem is all that potential means nothing if you're, you know. Just, you if, know if the teams are just not very good and the Jaguars are just historically bad. Or if we're talking about guys who can be. historically bad, so it's like. Hard enough to get to a Super Bowl with, with good teams, you know. Yeah. Like, let alone. Especially that division now. Yeah. Tough. I mean, it's. I mean, someone's going to win that division, winning nine games, maybe. Christian Barmore, our fourth auto for the New England Patriots. That's going to Corey. And then we saw that little bit, or a little bit before that, that Joe Burrow MVP contenders card. He may have some things to say about all that MVP and Super Bowl winning talk. Kyle Pitts, Jamar Chase. We'll have to randomize these at the end. As well, right? Would we do the, 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 the yeah? Unless they're serial numbered. Oh, okay. If it's, if they're serial numbered, I'll I'll do a separate one. A Here's separate our list for that. fifth auto. Jason Pinnock for the Jets. Cornerback for the Jets, New England, New York Jets, New England Jets, New York Jets going to Han. Herman, yeah. I mean, it's gonna be tough. I think Mac is pretty. Pretty dang good right now. You can only get better. See how long Belichick sticks around in any kind of role. So we're looking for a numbered card. A supernatural Patrick Mahomes. There's Tom Brady. Serial numbered. Just like we were talking about. Dwayne Eskridge and Tutu Atwood. Oh. 42 out of 99. So this will go to... That, that'll be... Yeah. So, so I'll, I'll do a separate list for that. Okay. That'll be over the players. Tutu Atwell and uh, Dwayne Eskridge. So the Rams, Rams. And, and Seahawks. I almost said Mariners. Let me just make sure. Justin with the Seahawks and the Rams is Andrew S. So no, we'll have to do that. And then a Quentin Portis Jr. Power. And uh, be sure to set that, uh, set that number going aside so you remember the randomize. Yes. That's what I should have done with the... With the uh, Herbie Burrow tour from NT. I don't remember to do that. Alright, that was box one. Remember, we still have uh, contenders number nine on the site right now. Patriots going to Mike? Yes, excuse me. Patriots are going to Mike. My bad. It's my, uh, you know, I used to not be dyslexic, but I think. All these numbers and letters and names kind of messing up on me. I think the older I get, I think I am getting a little slower. So yes, Mike, my, my apologies. That Barmore is going to you. Also, the the shipping team goes by the cards, not by the video. So yes, Chris could get all the names wrong in this, <laughs> but they'd still end up. In the I right would place. I would make the, I would amend the mistake as I most likely may be sorting this. I can feel it. My hair is getting... It's getting to the point in the night where my hair is getting a little crazy. Another guy on the back of that pack that may have some things to say about that QB talk is Lamar Jackson. Man, my Steelers are going to finish last by default in that division because that division is just stacked now. The Ravens are obviously good. The Bengals are obviously good. I think the Browns, unfor I think the Browns are going to be disappointing, but we are going to have some growing pains here. 
with Kenny running the offense. Although I do love our second round pick. He's a wide receiver from Georgia. That kid is a menace. No, <laughs> Mike gets it. Yeah, I uh, be, be that's fun. I think it's going to be another tough division, though, too. And I think we'll steal some games, Oliver. It'll be a, it'll be an interesting season, is all I'll say. And I think, I think TJ and, and the boys on the defensive end win us some games as well. Because they're that damn good. Defensive player of the year, TJ Watt, by the way. Oliver, let me ask you a non-biased question. Do you think TJ is going to be better than JJ, or as good? It's it's the it's the Cleveland way, Mike. And 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 yes, Coach Mike, legend, nine and eight. I think that's doable, honestly. You know, I think anything like eight nine seven eight nine. I think successful season. Man, on par. I think that's fair. I mean, JJ is a Hall of Famer. So if, if we got another Hall of Fame defensive player to add to the list of greats, then yeah, we'll do that. I feel bad for Baker, man. There, that sucks. That's a crappy situation. All right, box two. Good luck. I did see the backside of a redemption in there, so good luck to anyone who has that. I think there's going to make Baker sit out this season, which sucks. Of auto one off the top. You know I'm so good at that. Rookie thing of J24. Tefeli for the Jags. That's going to Mike. Yes. That one for sure, Mike. Jags. I've already seen some T Law love tonight, so let's get some more. Who says no? Nice. Winning ticket number to 99, Aaron Rodgers. 56 of 99 going to the Green Bay Packers. That's going too hot. Nice one. Supernatural Lamar. We'll see that up at the end. Lamar is cool, oh, man. Just stay healthy, kid. Seriously. <laughs> I want to watch you play. I do. Not against the Steelers, but I do want to watch you play. Our third auto, Kellen Mond on card auto. With the 11 on the signature as well. Let's go into the Minnesota Vikings. Skull Nation going to Corey S. Kellen Mond on card. And a Darren Waller for Joe's Raiders winning ticket. Saquon. I don't know how I keep doing here. Auto number four off the top. Nice. Playoff ticket. Brevin Jordan for the Houston Texans. Number 40 out of 99 Texans. That is going to Jeremy H. Auto redemption will be in the middle of this stack, so good luck, everyone. So we'll put this to the side. There's a rookie of the year, Trey Lance. They're letting Trey. Uh, they're gonna let Trey play here, which I I like. Got some pretty decent guys around him too. So we'll save the redemption for the end of this box. Our last auto of box two. Oh no, I'm tripping. Sean Waite, auto. How many hours do we have in this box? It might be slipping here. Sean Waite, another pass. Hmm? What's in your wallet? What's in your wallet? 
Sean Wade, another auto wallet? for the Patriots. And that Patriots auto is for sure going to Mike. Mike F. Oliver Cohen, 2 2 on the auto. Redemption. Alan Robinson, chain movers. Let's grab. Good luck, everyone. All right. Good luck. Rookie ticket. Card 174 of Nick Bolt. Nick Bolton, top of your head, do you know? Nick Bolton sounds like a, a 49er. It does sound like a 49er. <laughs> so Nick Bolton, I'll do a quick check here. Yeah, I got it, I got it. You got it? Nick Bolton is a chief. Chief. Kansas City Chief, Nick Bolton, rookie ticket auto. Chiefs, going to Han. Oh, the right lock of my hair in my face. I don't know why I put KCC. KC is the way it is. Nick Bolden, rookie ticket. <laughs> is he that same guy? No, you're thinking of uh, Nick Cannon. Or Michael Bolden. One, two, three, four. No, it was five. Okay. I thought I was tripping for a second. I thought we got one for free. You're thinking of my favorite my favorite Instagram user. Suck my bowl. Good name. Good name. All right, box number three, last box of this break. Thanks again, everyone, for getting this break filled out. Remember, number nine on the website right now, jaspyscasebreaks.com. Look, Renee. To the end. What's that? It's like a, it's like a Mike Bolden... Rod Stewart and like someone else song from like the Three Musketeers movie from the nineties. What? No, it was Sting. It was Sting, Michael Bolton, and uh, and Rod Stewart. Horribly generic song. They did a song for Three Amigos. No, Three Musketeers. Oh, Three Musketeers. <laughs> That'd be awesome. That would be a much better idea. Like you, you pay three very serious singers. To write it, to, to don't even have them write the song. You will sing this song that like the other, the actual three amigos sing. That's a great idea. Are you talking about the three Musketeers movie with Charlie Sheen? Yes, I am. Peter Sutherland, Chris yeah. O'Donnell, yeah. Oliver Platt, Tim Curry, Rebecca De Mornay. What a cast! Stack very as '90s of a cast as you can wow. possibly get. Yeah. Great. You ever see Jack Frost? The movie where Michael Keaton dies and becomes a snowman? Yeah, yeah I, oh, I, I, yes, I know the movie. It's a great movie. <laughs> it was, uh, by the way, it was Brian Adams. Brian Adams, Stewart excuse me. Scene. Not Michael Bolden. Is there really a difference, though? Any? My apologies to any Brian Adams and, I guess, Michael Bolden, Michael Bolden fans. If there are any fans of either in the chat, I do apologize, but are there really any difference? No slander to the to, to two great guys. Michael Bold who did that awesome Lonely Island song. The Jack Sparrow song. Lonely Island has no right being as good. Ryan Adams is more of a rocker though, isn't he? Ryan Adams has a song that I like called uh Summer of sixty nine with Brian Adams. I'm thinking of who am I thinking of that is a... Uh, Oh my god. Uh, Wicked Game. Who, that, that's Chris Isaac, I think? Mm, yeah, that's big, Chris Isaac. Big difference. My, my apologies to Oliver. Michael Bolton and Brian Adams, super fan. Noted. When I think of Oliver... I think Chris Isaac might, might be more in line with the genre with uh, Michael Bolton, though. What a wicked game we do. I don't think I do know Michael Bolton. Make me dream of you. Good song. Look at, yeah, great, look again, great song. When I think of Oliver, I think Steelers. I Then I think Michael Bolton, and then I think the Kings. Those are the, the three things I think of when I think of Oliver. All right, box number three. Good luck, y'all. Thanks again. I don't know how I keep grabbing the stack that doesn't, 
And the first card on top is the auto. That's a Mac Jones, Justin Fields. There's got to be just, like a, just, just slight enough spacing that separates the card. Because I do that too. I'll it's grab, crazy. I'll grab the stack and it's like, oh, there's the auto. Maybe we're just kind of nice with it like that, you know? What a wicked thing to do. All right. Auto number one going to the g man Quincy Roche. Defensive end for the Giants. New York Giants. That is going to Corey. Corey S. Supernatural Trevor Lawrence is a nice one as well. Oh, look at that. Any more talk about this for the first time tonight. I need to refill on hundreds. Of course I can find a way to bring anything back to wrestling, but uh, there's a big, big wrestler. I'm talking like when I think of physically big. Andre the Giants. <laughs> Not quite as big. Uh, Sid Vicious. Sid Vicious was a crazy person. Former WCW and WWF world champion. Loved softball. He would skip Raw and Nitro tapings to go play softball. Supernatural Trevor Warren. Friends. People. That's how much he loved it. Just he, like, you know, I'm buddy's getting together. Yeah. Like, I can't miss it. Sorry, guys. Can't do it. Can't make the show tonight. I got, I'm pitching tonight. I'm bad in cleanup and pitching. Jalen Waddle, Rookie of the Year. Nice. Supernatural 99 of Tom Brady. We like getting numbered quarterbacks. Worst, was at one point the worst right leg injury to see, a leg injury I've ever seen in wrestling. There's been some horrible stuff since, but that was up there. One of the worst I've ever seen. Josh Allen winning ticket. Sweep that up. Next auto. Ian Book on card auto. Going to the New Orleans Saints. Going to Andrew S. Do not... <laughs> do not link me that video. Anyone. Watch it for yourself. It's not safe for life. Watch it at your own risk. MVP contender. A Baker Mayfield. Getting to our second stack. Nice. No randomizer on this one. Travis Etienne Jr. and Trevor Lawrence round numbers. Next auto, keeping it in New Orleans. Peyton Turner, rookie ticket auto. Another one going to Andrew. A Tom Brady playoff ticket, non numbered. Got a Gainwell Rookie of the Year. Jonathan Taylor Power. Another redemption. Keep that one for the end. Tony Gates Legendary Contenders. Two. All right. Guesses in the chat for our last redemption. Our second to last auto. Darren Hall. Going to the Falcons. Andrew S. Grabs another one. Darren Hall, cornerback rookie for the Falcons. All right. Our last card, our last auto is a redemption. Good luck, everyone. Rookie ticket variation. Okay. Okay. Card one, 44. J.C. Horn. Pretty sure that's the Carolina Panthers. J.C. Horn is indeed a Carolina Panthers. Nice. J.C. Horn, Carolina Packers. Rookie ticket variation of redemption. Once again, going to Andrew. All right. So that is the break. Son of old wide receiver Joe Horn. Remember Joe Horn? I do not remember Joe Horn, actually. Old Joe Horn. It's again, again to that point where... Sons of players that we watched when we were kids are playing now. It makes 19, us so horrible. 1996 to 99, the Chief. 2000, okay. 2006, a Saint. And a Falcon for 27, 2007.
2007? Four bowlers. Okay. Four four bowler Joe Horn. Not a, not a, not a, no slouch then. Yeah, no slouch. All right, so we have two randomizers to do, real. Actually, three, yeah? So the break credit, the left, right, and then for, then the last one for this 2-2 two, two Dwayne Eskridge. Yeah, I, I saved the break credit to last. Okay. Save the best for last. All right. So let's just do this one real quick. So two team randomizer of Dwayne Eskridge and 2-2 two, two Atwell. We'll bring it back to... Right here. So here's a fresh list. We'll just go Seattle and San. Nope, not San Fran. Rams. There's hair. And, and I would just uh, just kind of set all of it up. All of it, right here, yeah. right now. Mm -hmm. Right here, right now, right here, right now. So dice list. I need two dice. Just one dice is fine. One dice? Yeah, one dice roll for all three things all three? that we're doing. All right, cool. So let's do left, right first, actually. Left, right first. So we'll do... That's like the sort of the least... I try to kind of do it by like, you know... What do people want to see? Yeah, like... The What's left, the main event? Yeah, the left, right's the most generic. And then this, the next one is the next step up. So that would be what... Seattle and Los yeah. Angeles Rams. And then we got to figure out who gets the uh, entries for this. So alphabetized by column A this is how I do it. And then you can highlight Andrew's, right? Andrew's names. And you can see in the bottom right, it says eight, count eight. So now half of those become entries. So highlight to four, copy, and I just paste it. Thank you, Andrew. I would actually paste it into column on the D. side. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just put it right there. And then that, that way you can just highlight everything. And Corey got two. So he would get just one. Nope. Here. Nope. And same thing here. And actually just delete all that for now. Just do it at the end. Just highlight all at once. Makes at the sense. End. All right. And Han. Cody Evans at home right now. Got six spots, so it's really three. He worked. And then he worked the store, yeah. Harry. He's got two. One entry. So Harry has one. Janet with two, so it means Janet has one. One entry. Jeremy has two, so Jeremy has got one. one. Okay. Justin got two. Perfect. Mike. Uh, with six, so we need three. Three entries. And then Terry with two. That's an entry. Terry's got one. All right. There is going to be so our then, list. Uh, so everyone kind of kind of spot check, you know what I mean? So we got Andrew, we got Corey, we got Han, we got Harry, Jan. Janet, Jeremy, Justin, Mike, and Terry. Okay. All right, so everyone in the break gets at least two teams. Thanks again, y'all. Appreciate that. So here's going to be our list. Yeah, that's right. That's so six Andrew, teams. Andrew, Andrew, Corey, Han, 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 Harry, Janet, Jeremy, Justin, Mike, 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 and Terry. Got everybody. Perfect. Cool. Now one dice roll, and then we just go left to right. One dice roll for all three. For the left to right, the randomizer between uh, Seattle and Los Angeles, and then our players. Good luck, everyone. Two dice. Two and a one is three. Makes it easy. Three times. Here's the first one, left to right. Good luck. One, two, and three. So right. Cards back on the right. So yeah, on the back of the card, right side teams will get them. Right side. All right. All right, so that's just one. So still three times for our Seattle and Washington and Los Angeles. Good luck. One, two, and three. So Seattle. That's going to the Seahawks and going to Justin. Justin, congrats. And the big, big one. Top two spots. We go back to here. So this is still this is nine, but it still applies. Top two names each win five hundred dollars in break credit. Once again, a one and a two is three. Three times. All of our players. Thanks again. Good luck. One, 
two and three. Top two spots three times. Han and Andrew, the songs. Nice. Thanks, you too. Thanks again to everyone. Appreciate you. Three to 16. You know, I'm sorry. Better luck next time. Thanks for playing, though. But one and two, Han and Andrew getting the $500 in great credit. That's going to do it for this Contenders football break. Remember, it's once again, Contenders number nine on the site right now. We'll be back very, very soon with another break. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.